why do we require a twin tube connection and what do we gain by it in this section we're going to learn about the advantages of using twin tubes stroboscopic effect in lights operation of twin tube connections in series and parallel unlike incandescent lamps which emit constant light due to heat fluorescent lamps extinguish itself every time the voltage wave passes through zero it's approximately 100 times per second for a 50 hertz frequency power supply if rapidly moving objects are viewed in this light it could give a strange effect this is called the stroboscopic effect though the flickering may not be noticeable under normal circumstances danger can arise when moving machinery is present spokes of a wheel when rotating at the same speed as that of the supply appear to stand still this could result in accidents when an operator touches the wheel thinking that it's stationary to avoid this effect modern tubes contain fluorescent powders which possess an afterglow to minimize the task period this can further be eliminated by connecting adjacent lighting points to different faces of supply so that minimum of light occurs on different lamps at different times twin tube connections can be made in series as well as parallel if the tubes are connected in series then it is possible to connect them with two 20 watt lamps and one 40 watt choke however each lamp must have its own starter this is also called a tandem connection after checking the accessories individually for their proper working connect them as shown in the circuit diagram a 40 watt choke and two 20 watts 110 volt starters are to be used for the purpose next insert both the two feed tube lights into their respective holders turn them by a quarter turn in their position and switch on the power by adjusting the tube lights a bit you could see both the lights glowing the stroboscopic effect can be avoided by wiring twin lamp fixtures with one lamp wired inductively and the other with a leading current by the use of a capacitor while the normal pf improvement capacitor is omitted another capacitor of 3.8 mfd is connected in series with one of the lamps and the choke windings are dissimilar the lagging current in one lamp is balanced by the leading current in the capacitor circuit thus the currents and light outputs differ in phase by approximately 120 degrees and the total pf is nearly unity to sum it up the twin lights are connected in series by this way they are connected in parallel like this with a pf improvement capacitor a twin tube industrial fitting to counter the stroboscopic effect is connected like this in this section we have seen the advantages of the twin tube connection the stroboscopic effect of light and the series and parallel connections of twin tubes